I usually don't do comedy on this channel, but this story is pretty funny to me. Uh, you, you be the judge. But essentially, uh, Toyota decided to open up a, a, a large number of patents uh, for the electric car technology. Um, so I'll tell you why they did it, what specific technology it was for, what they decided to include, and how they're actually planning on making money on this. I, I, I know, that they're planning on making money on exposing the free battery. I'll tell you all about it, so let's talk about it. It, uh, right now. Welcome to E4Electric, your number one source of unbiased electric car news. If uh, this is your first time here, that's perfectly fine. I'm not mad. Just uh, go ahead and click on that subscribe button so uh, we can meet here every day and talk about the exciting world of electric cars. Uh, but most importantly, you'll become part of this amazing community that you see down here in uh, the comment section, minus the trolls. But that's just, uh, just, uh, that's just part of the life, I guess. All right, so let's talk about Toyota. Now, Toyota announced that they're opening up 24,000 uh, patents. Uh, uh, for the electric car technologies that they have. Now, I am saying it with a straight face just because I got all the laughing out of the way earlier this morning when I saw this, uh, and it's for 10 years. Just for to after that, you're just gonna have to pay for it, guys. Now, so first of all, let's just talk about the fact there's 24,000 of those patents. Like, if there's 24,000 pieces of technologies that you have in there uh, uh, that need to be patented and protected from everybody else stealing them, how in the world do you keep producing this non-electric cars that are still not very good? I, I mean, I mean, seriously, I, I, and I'm not a patent attorney. I don't know much about all this, but like, are there even 24,000 parts in, in, in your cars? Um, so that, that, that's just number one. Number two, why in the world would anybody want to take this? The, their car, I mean, Toyota, Honda, and, and Ford, they're the companies right now that are way behind everybody else. Um, the startups, the legacy manufacturers, they're way back there. They, I, I man, they got cojones on them to, 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 to say this. Uh, so, yeah, no, but the funny thing is that they're opening this up only for the high. So if you want to take it from them for some reason, create your own car company. If you already have one somewhere over there, uh, you know, you can only use this if you're creating a hybrid cars, plug-in hybrid cars or uh, hydrogen fuel cell cars. But if you're creating an electric car, you're on your own. Toyota is just not going to help you with that. Um, and again, remember, this is for 10 years. So now uh, they've already opened up, I think about 5,000, 5,500 or so of those patents uh, earlier this year. Um, nobody noticed, um, but, but this time around, I guess they ended up having a bigger press release. So it, the word got out. Uh, now here's, a, here's also just a, a, hilarious, a hilarious part. Uh, I will, before I tell you guys, let me just, uh, before I forget, um, let me remind you that this video and this channel is sponsored by Byton. Check out the Byton and Byte, the all-electric SUV coming to the United States and Europe next year, starting at only $45,000. Uh, and I'm a reservation holder myself. Um, I think you should be as well. Uh, it's free to make a reservation, so you can go to Byton.com uh, or browse to the reservation link in the description of this video and reserve your Byton today. Okay, we're back to this to this uh, 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 comedy special that, that Toyota is uh, providing for us today. So they, um, yeah. So on top of that, they're going to charge people for doing support. So if you're getting their patents and, and you're gonna start using it, they will actually charge you to call them up and, and ask you how, how in the world you, you, you do this. And yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> it is unbelievable. Um, hello, hello Toyota. Yeah, Elon here. Listen, I'm having, I'm mean, having trouble. How do you, how do you make the cars, you know, not very attractive, and at the same time behind on the technology by about ten years? I, I can't figure that out. <laughs> Just it, it is. I, I mean, I I would love to know which company will actually take them up on this. Um, on this offer, and uh, this is this is the only, by the way, press image that they put up together with with a press release, which. I'm not really sure what we're looking at here, um, and I'm not really sure if anybody wants it. Now, you guys know I've been a big critic of t you know Toyota and Honda and Ford and so forth. At least Ford, Ford is now turning around. They're just about to announce um, an electric car that's based on Mustang. So they're, maybe they're going to be off my blacklist. But you know, with Toyota con consistently refusing to get into the game, consistently refusing to to even acknowledge that it's a thing, um, it, you know, it, they, they've been they've been definitely on everyone's 
you know, blacklist as far. And even when they do come up with one, because they will have to, I'm not really sure if I want to give them money, to be honest with you. This is one of the reasons I got a Chevy Volt and never considered the Honda Clarity, because I don't want to give Honda uh, money, because I think they haven't deserved the money from somebody who supports an electric uh, electric car revolution. Uh, let me know what, what you guys think. Uh, if, if, if Would you buy it, uh, a Toyota all-electric car whenever they decide to come up with it? Um, I'm definitely curious to know about that. Uh, all right, so let's uh, just just, you know, just, just for the fun of it, let's let's talk about positives and negatives. All right, so the positive, if there's anything here, is is we we got entertained today and I got a good laugh. But also, listen, anytime electric cars are in the news, right? Anytime there's any kind of encouragement uh, to create electric car uh, technology, it's always good. And you know, who knows? Maybe somewhere, you know, like in in a country that maybe does not necessarily have the funds or incentives from the government, like you know, maybe India and some other countries where you know they might benefit from this. And if somebody creates something that will promote this. Uh, you know, that's, that, that would be a good thing. You know, that, that definitely would be a good thing. So, so uh, there is, there is a little bit of positive in the story. Uh, but of course the negative is that, you know, Toyota is just going to complete denial at this point. I mean, this, you know, to, to, to do something like this, I think you have to be in a complete and auto denial. Not that that's any type of news. We've, we've known that they have been in a while and I think it won't stop until they probably get a new leadership, new board, um, new CEO. Or all of the above, if you really ask me. Uh, but you know, it's it's definitely you know you know it's funny actually. There's another thing to the story is that um, uh, uh, you know Electric did a story on this. I, I think it was Fred writing this, uh, and uh, and I think he was basically suggesting that uh, Toyota is trying to trick other companies to continue producing this crappy technology so they can continue selling their crappy technology. So it's in, actually interesting interesting points. I haven't I haven't mentioned that, but but I'm not really sure if they're that you know that the evil plan but if it is it would be even funnier so uh just wanted to mention that because uh i saw that um uh on their on their uh on their website earlier today by the way let me give a quick shout out to one of my uh, newer Patreons, Robert Samira. Thank you so much for joining my Patreon community. The only place where you can watch this live. If you need some comedy in your life, uh, this is the place. Uh, but thank you to all of my Patreons for contributing to this independent channel. Um, I do this full time. So without your help, this journey would have been much, much tougher. If you guys want to join me uh, there on Patreon, boom, patreon.com slash e for electric. Uh, the link is also in the description of the video. I really, really appreciate it, guys. And I I love doing this live shows for you, so uh, join me there if you would like. All right, guys, I am looking forward to your comments. Other than that, see you next time, and remember to stay charged.